Welcome to Castanet's Evening Update. I'm Wayne Moore. At the top of the news, what began as a major police incident in West Kelowna Thursday morning may have been a dispute between neighbors. Police converged on the 3100 block of Boucherie Road at 9 a.m. after receiving reports of shots fired. About an hour later, a man was arrested, but later released unconditionally with no charges being laid. The man's wife claims the incident centers around a dispute between her husband and a neighbor. She says they don't have any guns. Police are still investigating. A large wildfire near Lytton continues to burn out of control. The fire, which started yesterday afternoon, is pegged at 500 hectares. Evacuation orders and alerts remain in place. A 54-year-old Abbotsford man faces second-degree murder charges in the death of Deborah Novaclus at a Kamloops motel over the weekend. Dennis Miller was arrested Thursday without incident. The 117th edition of the Interior Provincial Exhibition in Armstrong opened to sunny skies and record crowds Wednesday. 18,327 people made their way through the turnstiles. The fair wraps up Sunday. It looks like a bumper crop for apples in the Okanagan. More than 40,000 cartons of apples, nearly twice as many as this time last year, have been shipped to retailers. And Health Minister Terry Lake announced today he will not seek re-election in next year's provincial election. Coming up tonight, a significant enrollment increase faces School District 23, and a Victoria doctor talks medical pot. For details on these and the rest of the day's news, keep it here at castanet.net. For Castanet News, I'm Wayne Moore.